Hello again. Today we're going to take a look at some vector drawing tools. Uh, every now and again you want to create a vector instead of a bitmap or uh, for whatever reason maybe you need to make a call out or a, a sales flyer or something crazy like that. So let's just dive into what's available. There's, there's of course Inkscape and uh, this is a free tool and we have this running here. And also there is OpenOffice which I'm going to run um, which has a drawing program in it. Open Office Draw, I'm going to open it, and let's try to create something like that in Open Office. All right, so uh, you could of course use one of the built-in uh, callouts, but let's make one from scratch just to get accustomed to the tools. Uh, callout being something like this. So let me get rid of that. Start with maybe a basic square or rectangle or a particular shape. Uh, let's be let's do something a little different let's use this shape here and let's add a, another shape to that let's add a uh, one of these little triangle shapes here and actually we want to flip this so let's right click and flip vertically and we want to put this somewhere like this and we're going to combine these two objects so I'm going to shift click and now I'll go to modify we don't want group that will just group them together but it won't make them part of the same objects and we don't want combine because that'll like do a, a boolean where there's like an intersection there so let me undo that we actually want to go to modify and shapes and make sure these are selected of course modify shapes and merge and that will merge those two objects into a single shape and that could be basically our call out right there but let's do a little bit more to it we can of course change the color uh, we can give it something other than a color such as a gradient and select a gradient for it something to that effect uh, but i think i'll just go with a single color And let's edit this shape now. We want it to, uh, to look different than that. Let's uh, go here where it says points. And that will let us actually edit the point of this object or the points in the object. And I'm going to move this down. And I'm going to move this over some. And I want this to be a more interesting shape. So uh, there we go. That's basically the steps to creating objects in a, in a drawing program. Uh, there's other things we can do. We could round these shapes off. Uh, let's try that out. Let's see. Select a single point and smooth transition. And that'll smooth out the transition between those. Uh, bear, bearing in mind these are created with curves. They're not just uh, polygons or single lines. They're actually uh, parametric curves. So let's uh, let's do that again. Let's click a, click a uh, thing there and select um, smooth transition. And there you go. I think I'll do that. Let's do that for two points at the same time. Now let's select two points. Let's try that again. Let's select two points at the same time and smooth them out. Smooth the transition. And there you go. So um, you can, of course, edit these, these control points uh, and do all sort of things with these. So that is basically an introduction to creating vector objects. Um, Maybe we'll talk more on the subject uh, later. So thanks for watching and uh, see you then.